First, create an object. I'm creating a new shape layer and using the ellipse tool to make a circle. Next, we need to create a new null object by going to the layer menu, then new, and then null object. This creates an invisible object for our shape to rotate it around. Next, we are going to make the null object the parent to the shape I created. Go down here where it says parent and select the name of the null object layer we created. This tells the shape to go wherever the null object tells it to go. Its position depends on the null object. Next, we need to change the anchor point and position of the null object. You can bring these options up by pressing A, holding shift, and pressing P. Change these values around until the null object is in the center of the circle. The little red circle representing the anchor point needs to be in the middle, and the red square should have the anchor point in its middle as well. Once this is done, we need to go to the shape layer and change its position to somewhere on the circle. Once that's positioned well, go back to the null object and bring up the rotation control by pressing R. Then we need to change the time indicator to whatever time we want to start the movement at. I'm starting at zero and going to make the shape move until the five second mark. Add a keyframe to the starting time. Then go to your ending time and add another keyframe. However, change the value to 360 or negative 360 based on the direction you want the shape to go. Now you have an object rotating in a perfect circle.